Dairy farming in mountain regions is directly linked to the preservation of the cultural landscape for tourism. The Fender family runs a traditional dairy farm in Tyrol. The construction of the new barn is a decisive step to continue dairy farming in the future. For this, the old, labor-intensive tie stall was removed and a new, modern freestall barn was built. Hello, I'm Gabriel Fender. Last year, we built a new barn for dairy cows and young stock. We are here in the Tyrolean lowlands in the district of Schwaz. We have three feed alleys here. At first, we considered installing three modular cow robots, but we actually needed three of them. Now, with the N-Row that we ended up choosing, it's the more affordable solution, and the cross alleys are also being cleaned now. The Enro manure removal robot has proven itself to be excellent for scraping slatted floors in cattle barns. But it can also be used for cleaning solid walking surfaces in smaller barns. In comparison, the Enro Plus has more capacity, suitable for cleaning small to medium-sized walking areas. With a weight of 450 kilograms and a height of only 40 centimeters, the Enro is especially compact and heavy, which also makes it very reliable in operation. When cleaning solid walking surfaces, the slurry and manure must be pushed into a cross channel. In the case of the Fender family's freestall barn, the walkways in the dairy cow area are scraped up to eight times. For this, the Enro requires three passes per lane and two empty runs to be able to dump the manure onto the manure pile beneath the barn. Using PC route planning software, the different routes for the cows, the outdoor area, and the young cattle side are planned. The big advantage is that route optimizations can also be made later on, without having to spend a lot of time reprogramming the robot. After completing the cleaning path, the Enro follows the pre-programmed route back to the charging station to recharge its battery. So that the Enro can also clean the young cattle side at the Fender family's farm, a tunnel was installed. Gabriel Fender manually starts a route twice a day when he goes into the barn. The tunnel allows the feed alley to be accessed as usual by tractor, while also providing the Enro manure robot with a connection to the young cattle side. There, it even has to overcome an incline of nearly 10% before it can clean the walkway. If needed, the Enro can also be manually started from a specified route point to return along the route to the charging station. The entire barn planning and equipment was supplied by Shower Agrotronic. The proven top safe feed fence is especially quiet, and the comfort cubicles are animal friendly and robust. Everything is of the highest quality from Shower Agrotronic. The dairy barn was designed to be especially animal friendly. In addition to alpine and pasture operations, the cattle also have access to an outdoor run. There are also feed fences and comfort cubicles adapted to the size of the young animals available. For the calves, there are four functional calf pens, and for two horses, a horse box has been installed. Everything has been thought through in detail, brought together into an optimal overall solution. Emission reduction included. We have three walkways here. In each walkway we have slurry here. And there is a 2% slope so that the walkways drain faster, because that's better for hoof health. For funding for barn construction, you have to implement an emission-reducing measure. That was the final reason why we've always had manure and also wanted to spread solid manure on the fields again, not just slurry. The covers of the slurry channel are typically opened twice a year by Gabriel Fender to thoroughly clean the channel. At the beginning, it took us a bit of time to set it up. Someone from the company shower came and did it with us. Then we entered the basic route. But now we've actually had it for almost a year already, 
Of course, we were also able to adjust a few things ourselves using the PC program that comes with it. And now it actually runs perfectly. And now in the mornings and at night when we go to the barn, we don't have to go in with the shovel to the cows that are walking around or anything like that. 